The Tech Times, some cool apps will help put your student at the top of his or her class. <laughs> Technology consultant Francie Black is here to show us how they work. Hello. Hello, how are you? What do we have? Well, we got school next week. So <laughs> Can you believe it? Summer <laughs> no, is coming to an it's end. It's gone, it's gone. And I've got three really cool apps. So apps are obviously getting more and more powerful. And I've got three apps to really help you with your schoolwork. Okay. okay. So the first one is you do need to do your math homework first before you use this, okay? So this is a pretty cool app. So this one is called Photomath. And Photo math, and it's a camera calculator. And if you look up here, I'm going to place, I'm in the app, and I'm going to place it right over the math problem. And do you see my answer up there in red? Oops, let's see, I'm shaking a little bit there. Okay, there we go. And you can go down to your next one and check it. Got your answer. Oops, I'm going to get it right over it. There we go. There's our answer. Go to the next one. Wow. There's our answer. Yeah, right. do your homework first, first. <laughs> because otherwise that's cheating. That's cheating. <laughs> well, and they do have it. So if you don't, uh, if you're having a hard time getting through it or you're not getting the right answer, you can go into the details of it and it will give you every single step along the way. How to do it. And show you how to do wow. it. So do your homework first. That's great for those of us who may maybe forgotten our algebra. That's right. All right. <laughs> and we're trying and to this, help kids. And this particular course or this particular app, it covers arithmetic, trigonometry, logarithmic functions, so it goes way up in math wow, skills. Cool. So really cool, and you can even type in um, your math problems as well on their math calculator. All right, so the next one is for science. So that was math, now we got science. And this is a periodic table, but it's not just any periodic table. This is actually by the Royal Academy of Chemistry that put this out. But you can tap on any of the elements and, of course, get all the details very quickly and easily. It actually even has videos with it so you can get more information about it. You can tap on it and get facts. So you can go down here to uses and properties and get details on it. Wow. So you can get this all in one place. Um, you can go down here and where it says temperature. You can tap on that. And if I scroll and watch my, my grid up here in the table, okay, see, so oops, just lost it, sorry. Try that again. Bring it up here, temperature, okay. And you can just slide it, and it's telling you the point in which it changes from solid to gas based on temperature. And um, you can also go over here and get densities um, and tap on it, and it changes it. So you can get all this information in one place wow. very quickly, very easily, with all kinds of supporting information. So quick one for, um, for those of you in science. Now, this last app that I want to show you is called edX. And um, this is, there's a lot of online learning programs, okay? The distinction between edX and some of the others is these, all come, these courses all come from top universities, okay? So I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna filter my courses, but I want you to see this list down here. I was really impressed with um, who partners in this. So if you scroll down here, you can see that this is Berkeley, Brown, Boston University, Caltech, um, oh, wow. Columbia, Cornell, okay? Dartmouth, so, yeah, Dartmouth, Davidson. Okay. Exactly. So, um, so you've got awesome classes that are free, believe it or not, these classes are free, and uh, you can take them, um, they're mostly scheduled like they would be a college course. So you can say what's coming up, what's starting soon. There's 200 classes starting soon. Um, there's self-paced ones in just about any subject, architecture, biology, life science. Now, the last thing I wanted to point out on this is that um, some of these classes, if they have this verified tag, you can actually, the classes are free, but if you want to get a certificate with the name of the school, the institution that's providing it, as well as signature by the instructor, you can get a certificate and you can use that to build your resume, resume to say that, hey, I'm certified in this particular area. So this is sort of, you know, for the college. And that part you pay for. You and that part you do pay for. And that's okay. what funds the free classes. So pretty cool stuff. If you want to learn more about the apps that Francie showcased, just go to the Tech Time section at WLOS.com.